it just never seemed natural for us to write songs in Danish. We have written some kind of joke songs in Danish, but we never actually wrote in Danish. I think there's a <laughs> bunch of reasons. I think part of it is, is uh, even though the lyrics are kind of you know vague and open for interpretation, I still want to convey the message of the lyrics, you know, and we, we want people to to understand the words, you know, and, and there are only five million people who speak Danish, so it's it's kind of limiting that way, you know. Um, that's one of the reasons. I guess another could be ambition. I'm not sure. And it's we, just I, I grew up listening to English music. Yeah, it's, I think it's hard to understand for non uh, for Americans or English people because we don't feel like English is like a second country a uh, uh, language almost. We feel like it's part of our own language because a lot of culture is is. Uh, presented to us in, in, in English and um, it feels you know it feels very natural it doesn't feel like a second language so I think in that sense it's you know it's it's a very it's a natural thing to do I think Trent Resner had been asking about us a little bit we we knew that he was interested in what we were doing and he asked us to go on tour uh, while we were making the record so we couldn't go which was a bummer and then he asked us again when we were done with the record, and so the opportunity was there, and we gladly took it, you know. And uh, it was great. Was it kind of sad seeing them like kind of go? Like, was there a feeling of sadness, like, or was it just like kind of playing normal shows? I think there's definitely a bittersweet feeling to it, you know, and and also the fans at the shows, you could tell that they had that, you know, bittersweet feeling. So it kind of reflected on everything. Mm -hmm.